I'm going to try to get in. Netflix, okay, it's got, uh, all right, we got filled at 286, that's good. And let me put it on monitor and then we can, we got a nice uh, nice entry there and Netflix is moving up now, okay. So this is a, a good entry. All right, approaching 50% uh, now, I'm going to close two or three actually. Okay, it's at 415. Okay, got it, 425. So we are out on three contracts out of the five. Netflix uh, facing some resistance here. Um, I say let's just close it out. It was a great uh, entry there. Okay, all right. So 3.6, we got out of the trade. So at 565. So that's about 40%, I would say. Okay, so that the first trade was right here, and we finished Netflix. That's at uh, we closed the profit of 40%. Now just opened Baidu. Let's just go into a five contract because that's really the position I wanted to be in. So 2.76, okay. So we are in uh, on Baidu. It should be a full five contract position at this point, and that would be a delta of 172. That's about $1,330 trade. About $160, $150 here, just a little over 10%, about 12% maybe. But I sense uh, some resistance here, okay. All right, I'll take 10% and uh, move on. Let's let's do that. I'm taking it 2.92. That would be a profit of uh, just about exactly 10% right there. Okay, I'm going to take it. All right, so we got in and that should be just 11% right there, okay. So the way I look at this day trading environment is I'm looking at it as if I have an account size of 30,000. And the reason for the 30,000 is because of the pattern day trader rule, which is which kicks in at 25. So if you have an account less than 25, then you're subject to pattern day trader rules. And so you don't want to be affected by that. So I'm assuming that I have an account of 30,000. And then on a daily basis, if we can make 300, 400, 500, like today we made 700. Yesterday, I think it was 500 something. So that is a great performance for a, for, for, uh, for day trading on a $30,000 account. So everything I do is with the assumption of a $30,000 account and each trade should not go when it's fully doubled down and everything. It should not go more than uh, 5,000, 6,000 at most. But we never even get there because most of the trades we enter at uh, somewhere between $1,500 and $2,500 or $3,000 and with the intention of doubling down if required. Okay. So that's the philosophy of uh, this. Now, granted, everyone's account size is different. And so if you have a much larger account, then you can scale up on your contracts as you as you, uh, you know, as you wish. But I would say day trading in general is uh, a speculative uh, activity. So you don't want to put, uh, you know, the entire uh, you don't want to put uh, too much uh, into these trades because they can turn around and they can go against you. And so. The best way to look at it is you have a sort of a portfolio of uh, you know somewhat swing trades, much uh, uh, somewhat longer uh, longer term trades, and you use the day trading to just supplement that. And if you can do that consistently day after day after day, um, of course you will see losers uh, or break evens and things like that. But uh, if you can control that, uh, then this produces a very consistent and good return. So that's the basic philosophy of these trades uh, that it's based on a thirty thousand dollar account and on an individual uh, trade of about no more than five six thousand dollars and if you have two trades going then that would be about ten thousand dollars but we, we you know re uh, rarely we do that as well so uh, it's it's basically just very tight con tightly controlled environment and you just chip away at it on a daily basis all right so now it's looking bearish uh, so i'm just going to put it back on market watch uh, there's really nothing we can do right now Baidu is still looking strong. There's no question, but uh, Amazon is weak. The S&P is looking weak. So I'll just put it back on market watch. So if you want a free trial of this day trading signal service, you can go to this bit.ly link. It's bit.ly uh, slash day hyphen signals. Now the day and the, uh, the D and the S has to be capitals. And once you go there, you can get a free trial. You can, you'll need to sign up there and you'll get a free trial. And uh, at the end of one week, if you don't want to continue, you can just send us an email at info at optiontiger.com and we'll give you a full refund. So once again, the bit.ly link is bit.ly slash day hyphen signals with the DNS in caps. Thank you.